Well, hello there, my friends. Welcome back to my channel. It's Lowball Mama. And this is the long-awaited Timu haul that I have been telling you all about. Now, this haul is going to be a little bit long. So, get you something to drink. Get you something to snack on. Sit back and relax and enjoy what we got. And let me tell you the truth, guys. I did this, this little haul a while ago so i truly don't remember all of the stuff that i got so i'm going to be just as surprised as you are now this is actually two hauls together um the first haul i did y'all was kind of a let me see haul and that was a small order that i did because i was just like um let me see if this stuff gonna really come let me see if it's gonna come when they say it's gonna come let me see what type of quality this stuff is going to be like. And, uh, yeah, that was my first haul. So, I only got a, a little bit of stuff, you know. Just some I insignificant things that, you know, I really didn't have to have, but I just wanted. And then the second shopping um haul that I got was one that, you know, it was a little bit more of what I actually wanted and needed once I saw that things were going to come correct. And um that first order... It came exactly when they said it was going to come. I didn't have any issues with it. Um, and yeah. Now the second order took a little bit longer to come. Um, because they said some of the stuff that I had was like, um, you know, high demand. But they did give me a $5 credit for waiting on it. And what I like about this, uh, this little store right here is they also kept you updated. You know, I didn't have to go online and search and... And look around and try to find out what was going on with my stuff. They sent me like um, daily emails or every couple of days. Letting me know exactly what was going on with my merchandise. And so I do appreciate that. And guys, a lot of the stuff, like most of the, the things that I got were like under $5. I might have got a couple of things that were over. And um, we're just going to jump right in and see what we got. Okay, so... This first thing I got were these sponges right here. And these are just, you know, just your average little kitchen sponges um, for washing the dishes. And they're, they have um, a little scrubby side and then, of course, the soft side. So I thought that these would be good just to, you know, to use in the kitchen. And that's how they look. Okay, we're just going to set this over here. Okay. And let's see. The next thing I got were these little sponges right here. Guys, and I'm really uh, kind of crazy about little stuff that I use in my kitchen. But I got these right here. And these are more for your, like your pots and pans. So they don't do so much damage to your pots and pans. But they're, there's a little, little Brillo on this side. They're not too... Uh, aggr aggressive abrasive and then there's a soft side right here and there's one two I mean here one two three four five of these and these sponges were one two three four five ten of those sponges so yeah that's how they look okay and the next thing I got were these little towels right here for your hair, you wrap around your hair after you finish washing your hair. And I thought these were so cute. These little towels. I'm gonna open one up so you can see how they look. This is how they look. So you won't have to use your your great big towel after you wash your hair. Put your hair right in there. <laughs> Got a little bear on the front. And yeah. Okay. And I got three of those guys. And then I got these little microfiber towels. You know, it's always good to have some. Some little microfiber towels for wiping things down. A little computer, 
your shelves, you know, your tables, whatever you want to use them for. And there's one, two, three, four, five of these different little colors. Looks like good quality, guys. You know, I know, I mean, it's not the best, but yeah, they look like they'll do the job. I think they're going to be pretty good. Okay. And next, what else do we have? I got some more cloth. Um, these are cleaning cloths too. This is more for in, in my kitchen. I'm gonna use these for like wiping my kitchen table off right here. Yeah, it's a little towel. Got a little design around the edge. It's pretty cute. Okay, and it's just. One, no, it's two of these in here. There's two of these. Yeah, that's a two pack. Okay, and next, guys, I really don't even know. What is this? I don't know what these are. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, these are more hair towels, y'all. <laughs> I got three more hair, hair, hair towels for. After you finish washing your hair, just little towels. I'm sorry, y'all can't see that too well, but you lay it down right here. Like this. Yeah, just little hair towels. You put your hair in there. Put your head in there so you won't have to use an extra big towel. And I got three of those. See, there's another pack of these sponges right here, y'all. Two, three, four, five. So, actually, I guess I got 15. There's five in this pack right here, too. Are these sponges? These are going to come in handy because the ones I have on my sink right now, they have seen their last days. So, yeah, these are going to come in handy. And we also have. I bought these little rings right here, y'all. They aren't real <laughs> gold or anything like that, but I thought they would be cute just to put on my hands to try and make my hands look a little bit. When I want to feel a little cute, see if I can get them open, y'all. See what they look like. They might not fit. Um, well, we're going to come back to those. Let's see what else we got here. And I got this little vegetable peeler right here. I needed one of these. Looks pretty sturdy. And I like that it's, it's kind of big, y'all. So you can grip it real well. And hold on to it. Let's take it out so you can see how it looks. Oh. I didn't really want to be on camera, y'all, because I'm, I'm just a hot mess. But yeah, this one is, this is nice. And it has some weight to it, too. This is kind of heavy. Stainless steel, yeah, I like this. This is nice. Okay, and what else do we have? Oh, and I got some of these right here, y'all. This is a little um a thing to put around your arms to tighten up some of the, the flabbiness on your arms. I decided I'd try. Two of those for my little flabby arms. Yeah, so I do have another one. We'll see how those, how this works. And they fold up. So, you know, they don't take up too much space. They fold up nicely. Yeah. And y'all forgive my nails. 
I have been scratching lottery tickets off. So that's a little bit of that lottery dust. But yeah. That's. We're going to try these. Let's see about that. Those flabby arms, y'all. And then I also got a. Um, this is a kitchen thermometer. Because I didn't have one. A meat thermometer. or Well, I guess you could take the temperature of whatever you're cooking. But. Yeah, just a little thermometer because I have uh, <clears throat> people in here that are just learning how to cook, just starting to cook. And I just thought this would be, you know, a safe way for them to make sure that the things that they're cooking is completely done. And it comes with it in a little holder. I thought that was cute. So, yeah, meat thermometer. And then I have, um, this is for the, well, for the onions, you're chopping onion, because I don't know about you all guys, but I have the hardest time chopping onions, because they always have a tendency to move and slide all around, so this is your onion chopper, well, your onion, you hold it, you stick it through your onion, and it'll hold your onion in place. Oh, guys, I'm so sorry. It'll hold the onion in place while you stick the knife through the little, through the little teeth and chop your onion. Oh, and it's got a little heart. That is so cute. I thought that would be good to try. And all of this stuff feels kind of it, it's heavy, y'all. It's not. It doesn't feel light and cheap and flimsy it feels like it'll, it's going to really hold up but you know we'll see and then I got um an egg slicer one, one of those because you know if you're making a little salad you want your eggs to look to look cute when you put them in your salad so Got this little egg slicer. You know, I'm trying not to break my nail. But yeah. Set your egg in there. Or whatever. I guess you could use it for other vegetables too. But put your egg in there and push it down. And you got sliced, perfectly sliced eggs. And like I said, y'all, this stuff does not feel cheap. This stuff has some, some weight to it. Feels nice and heavy. Okay. And what else do we have? Oh, and I got some um some little molds. Cookie molds. This has dumplings, skin molds. But <clears throat> I'm just gonna use them probably for I wanted really the biggest one for like biscuits. For when I'm making biscuits. But then, you know, you can use the other ones for whatever. There's three different sizes. That one. And this one. And this one. And those are nice, too. And they fit right, right inside of each other. So they don't take up much space. Yeah, those are nice. I like those. Yeah, what else do we have? I have my son helping me. Oh, and I got this because I wanted somewhere to put my Q-tips. So I bought this little Q-tip holder dispenser. I thought this was so cute. Okay, I need problems at the top. Can we go the other way? But yeah, you just put your little Q-tips in here, and it's a little dispenser, so. Nobody has to touch all over your Q-tips. 
You just reach down there and pull one out. Yeah, I thought that was cute. And the fact that this it's clear, so it'll go with any type of decor. Yeah. That's nice. I like that. I like it, y'all. And these are just little um, film covers that you can use to cover bowls with. Already, you know, already has a little stretch on them. And you just pull them out and just cover up whatever size bowl. If your bowl doesn't have a lid to it or whatever. Got a little bear on it. And it's, um, how many of these? Hundred. One hundred. A hundred little bowl covers, guys. And they're disposable. You just throw them away after you use them. Or recycle them. Whatever you like to do. Yeah. And what are these? Oh, shower cap. OMG, these are shower caps, guys. I didn't know. <laughs> I didn't know that there were going to be so many in here. <laughs> it's a whole bag. Oh, my goodness, a bag full of shower caps. Well, that's pretty awesome. I didn't know that there were going to be so many. Let's see. Let's open them up and see what... See what one looks like, guys. Cause I kind of, I wasn't expecting this. Uh, I'm trying to open it. See what one looks like. Let's tear it off a little bit. I see what one looks like. Hold on, guys. Bear with me. Just want to take one out and see. So I can show you what it looks like. Oh, wow, guys. <laughs> I don't know whose head this might fit, but, well, I guess they'll scratch out a bit. Yeah, they'll be all right. They open up some. Yeah, they'll work. They'll work. They do look a little bit flimsy, but it's like a million of them. <laughs> but, yeah, that's how they look. They'll work. Okay, what else do we have? We're about finished with that first bag. Are we on the second bag yet? Okay, yeah, we are on the second bag now. Um, next we have... How about this? This is just a little first aid bag. I'm going to put the stuff in here and make this, you know, just in case we need... You know, with all the stuff that's been going on... And stuff that may happen, you never know what you might need. So I'm just gonna put some first aid things in here because I have a lot of I have a lot of items. Some alcohol swabs and cotton balls, bandages, um, stuff like that. Just fill this up. I thought this was real cute. And blue is my favorite color, so yeah, I got that. And what is this? What is this? I do not know what this is, guys. Oh, these are the hampers. Oh, yeah, guys. These, ooh. <laughs> I got some little laundry hampers uh, for my family so they can put their laundry in. And when they're going to the washing house, stand it up. No, the, 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 the hamper. I'll show it. 
Yeah, that's pretty cool. I got each one of us one of these. So we can just put our clothes in there and tote them over to the little laundromat. Looks pretty good, guys. Looks sturdy. I think those are going to work. And it's folded up so nice and it has its own little holder. That is, well, actually, the holder is made on the side of it. Turn it around. That's the little holder right there. Stand it back up. See that right there? It folds and goes right back in there. So you don't have to worry about trying to trying to keep up with the little holder. That is awesome. Yeah, that's really nice. Like I said, I got like five of those, one for each of us. You don't have to worry about trying to fold it up. We'll put it back in a bit. What else do we have? Um, let's see what's next, guys. <clears throat> These are some little um, disposable cups that I got. Because when I'm doing my, my little, um... Food shorts. Sometimes I want to uh, put something to drink beside it. But I wanted some clear cups. So you all can see what I'm drinking. So got these little cups. And I think they are going to work just fine. Because I never um, drink that much juice. I'm not big on juice guys. I, I mostly drink water all the time. But this is just the right amount for me. But yeah, I thought those would work. These would work really well. And they can also, my kids can also put some little juice in them and put them in the freezer. And freeze them and eat them like little ice pops. Yeah, that's going to work real well. Got two, ba two packs of those, guys. This is the other, another one of the hampers. And this is how it comes. Still inside the little inside itself that those are nice and another really nice <clears throat> these are going to come in such great hand i really like these these are going to be so helpful and what else oh and then i got these little containers and these were like 80 Maybe 80 something cents each. Little containers. I don't know what I'm going to really. What I'm going to put in them yet. But I just thought they were so nice. Uh, let me open one up and see. Oh, they really got these. They really got this stuff packed. <laughs> I got like. I can't remember. I have four or five of these different different sizes. Oh, I got some measurements on it. Look at that. Got measurements on the back. Seal pot. I'm just opening one up so you all can see what it looks like. Oh, they got a real good tight seal on them, too. Oh, yeah. These are nice. I like these, guys. These are really nice. A real tight seal on it. <coughs> Excuse me. Those are going to come in handy. Then I got this. I don't even remember what this is, y'all. <laughs> this is it's a container. To, oh, yeah, I got this one for my pasta. I don't use this one for my for my spaghetti. Spaghetti. That's how it looks. Let me take it out the bag so y'all can get a better look at it.
This little deal right here. Yes, we're measuring. Oh, that's the top. Okay, that's the top, guys. All right, forgive me, y'all. <laughs> Put that on. That's the top of it. That's what that is. That's the lid. That is so cute. Actually, I think it goes the other way, then. The top. Turn the top around. Up, up, over. Yeah, like that. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> that is awesome, guys. Yeah, I'm going to put my spaghetti in that. Or you could put rice. And then you got the little top so you can measure it out. If you put rice in it, or couscous, or oatmeal, that is so awesome. Wow, that is awesome. Okay. Let's see. What do we have next? Okay. Let's see what we have next, guys. Oh, these are some trash bags I got. I wanted to try. They're trash bags. I don't know how good they are. I'm not going to really open these up, guys. They kind of look like tarplins. But they are trash bags. And there's five in each bag. Black trash bag. I do have to open them up and see if they're gonna fit fit my trash can. And we got another container. I got different sizes for different things, guys. Okay. What else do we have? Oh, and these are some um, small trash bags for my uh, bathroom trash can. Come in different colors. And how many are in here? There are 15 on this roll. Trash bags. And then I got this little cloth right here. I'm going to use this. Uh, probably for my dishcloth. As a dishcloth. How many of those came in the pack? Two of these. Yeah, I'm going to use these as dishcloths. This is nice, though, guys. This, this is really nice. I like this one. I like the, the texture of it. Kind of thick. Yeah, this is, you can use this for... You can use this for whatever you like. But I'm going to use it for my uh for my dishes, guys. Let me straighten this up. I'm going to use it for dishes. And then these are some more bags. The little trash bags because they came in different colors. This is blue. And then white. White and blue. trash bag and then this is a strainer of course I do I already have one strainer but I thought this one was kind of cute and kind of odd I think you could probably latch it onto your pot or something like that and strain your stuff out so I thought that was kind of kind of cute Little holes right there. Tip. <laughs> yeah. And what else do we have? Oh, this little thing right here. This is just like a little, a little gizmo gadget for, you know, if you have something stuck. I actually got it for my vacuum cleaner because sometimes uh, my vacuum cleaner gets clogged up. 
And I'll just use this to stick down in there and get out the clog. So yeah, that's what we're going to use that for. And then, what else do we have? And these are supposed to be refills for like the sweep, the swiffer, <laughs> dry sweeping cloths. I don't know guys, we'll give it a try. Because I have a swiffer. And those little cloths get pretty expensive, so I decided I'd try these. There's 30 in here. I'll let you know how they work. It's a lot more dust in here. Okay. We'll see. We'll see how they work. And what else do we have? Oh, and I got myself some slippers. Uh, these are one of the more expensive items that I got right here. Let's see. I haven't even looked at these yet, guys. But oh, Let's take one out and see. I don't know, guys. These look kind of crazy. <laughs> Slippers. That's how it looks. I don't like the bottom part so much. It looks like they might be soft, though. But we'll see. I really don't. I really don't like that bottom part. But we'll see. And what else do we have? I got my kids some socks. Just some little um, booty socks to walk around the house in. Something on their feet. So they won't be walking around the house in their white socks. Or they can wear them with their shoes. However they like. And I thought they were cute because they're different. Different designs. Different colors. And there's... How many pair in here? There's... Hmm. I don't see. I think it's like five. Let's see. One, two, three, four... Uh, yeah, I think it's like five pair. I got two packs of those. Little socks. Pretty socks. Okay, what else do we have? That's it. Okay, guys. Well, <laughs> looks like we went through everything. Well, I hope you enjoyed this little... Timu haul, guys. I'm sorry it wasn't as put together as I wanted it to be. I wanted to give you prices and everything and really let you see the items, but I hope you enjoyed it just the same. And believe you me, the next one that I have, it's going to be set up better than this one. I'll be more ready for the next haul. And I have already started putting my third uh, basket together. So, stay tuned for that, guys. Um, and if you enjoyed my video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up, um, like, and subscribe at Lowball Mama. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye, friends.